Hello? There we go. There we go. There's my there's my microphone. She's up and running again. Hooray. Okay. Um Hey gang. Um So as you can probably tell by either uh, my posts on either uh Instagram or Twitter or just, you know, the name of the stream itself, uh I'm not feeling it too great. Uh um, not feeling awesome, uh, but here we are, uh, we're gonna get through this, we're gonna work through, I'm happy to see all of you guys, I have been having not the best time <laughs> lately, but I'm honestly really excited to be here with you guys, I wasn't able to, oh, thank you so much for su the subscription, um, I was really bummed I could, didn't have the energy or just didn't feel well enough to play Lethal Company last night, but I feel a little bit better today. Um, so I'm here to hang out with you guys, and so I'm, I'm, I'm happy. I won't be able to give it, like, my all and, like, my typical amount of energy like I normally do just because I am not feeling great. Um, but I think we're still going to have a really good time. Um, hi, Nick. Happy birthday, buddy. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, buddy! Oh, hi, Mac! Hi, friend! Okay, guys, we're gonna do this thing! Hooray! Oh, thank you so much for the super chat! That's really nice! Oh, that's so nice of you! I appreciate you! You're doing great, Bess! Thank you, Nick! <laughs> thank you for spending part of your birthday with me, Nick! That's real nice! That's real nice, Nick! Also, um, I don't know how to do this eloquently, um, but like, I, I've made you two partner, which I'm really, really fortunate for, and I feel really lucky and blessed, and so thank you guys for that, like, that was all you, I really appreciate all of you so much, um, I implemented, uh, members, I think that means, or, like, is that something, I'm still getting the hang of YouTube, so hopefully that's the correct terminology, but, um, you're able to, like, join as a member on my channel now, and if you do so, you, you can, like, use exclusive, uh, emojis or something. Um, yeah. So, hooray. That, that's, that's a new update that is a thing. So, you, I have some really cute raccoon emojis that you can use. Um, if any of you were ever, um, subscribers on my Twitch. Oh, yeah, thank you so much, Justin Jones, for joining. If, yeah, any of you were members or subscribers on my Twitch, then they're the same uh, cute little emojis as before. They're, like, um, just, like, uh, there's a bunch of really cute ones. And then also you get a cute little raccoon next to your name, like Justin Jones has now. Um, and then uh, the longer you're a part of the raccoon uh, uh, platoon. Oh, th <laughs> thank you. Um, yeah, like, the longer you're a part of it, the raccoon changes over time, and the ultimate one is a uh, raccoon Mia, which is like a raccoon dressed as your Mia, which is very, very cute, and I'm very excited about it. Um, but yeah, there's all kinds of cute little emojis that you can use if you're a part. Um, I think I can show some of them, probably. I can! Yeah, here's some of them. Here, I'm gonna put those right there. There we go. There's some of those. That That's what they look like. There's tiny little Jennies. There you go. D dims for use. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, it, with that being said, let's go ahead and get started. But yeah, so that's a cool update, and I want to thank all of you guys for helping me get there, because that's, it's really, really cool, and, um, it's like, it's not an uncommon thing, especially because I'm Gen Z, but it's like, I, you know, ever since I was a kid, I dreamed of being a YouTuber or, like, having a YouTube presence. Um, and so being like a YouTube partner is really seriously a dream come true and I really appreciate all of you guys for helping me get here and I hope to just keep posting on this channel more this new year and to grow this channel even more and maybe one day get to 100,000 su subscribers and get that cool little plaque. I think that'd be really cool. But yeah, thanks everybody. Um, oh, Super Smash Bros fan, thank you so much. That's so nice. I really appreciate you. Wish I could, but I'm financially in no position to. That's absolutely fine. Seriously, like... Don't worry if you can't, like, it doesn't mean I like you any less or that you're, like, any less of a fan or you're any less important to me. I really, really appreciate you guys just being here and hanging out with me. Like, there's no, there's never any financial pressure 
but like if you can then i really appreciate it but if you can't that's okay too because i know that times are tough for a lot of people right now and so that's a-okay um let's start signing because <laughs> i really i really wish it was a bit but my stomach does hurt very badly um let's see ricky asks hey jenny have you ever met smosh um i met Damien Haas, and he's a part of Smosh. Damien's my very sweet, very dear friend. Oh my gosh, wait, Super Smash Bros. Fan Legend, I didn't realize that you super chatted $50. That's so nice of you. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much for that. That's so unbelievably generous. I really, really appreciate that. That's amazing. Oh, thank you. Yeah, Spike, don't worry. But yeah, like, Super Smash, thank you so much. But yeah, like... If you guys are able to become members or super chat, like, I appreciate it, but, or buy prints, like, all that's amazing, but there's never any pressure. Like, you guys are already more than enough just being here and spending time with me. I was waiting for you to implement memberships. Yes, and now I did it. I, I was, like, I was a very big, brave girl, and I went on YouTube.com and figured it out all by myself, and I didn't cry once. I cried over other things, but just not that. But, yeah, Ricky, I've, uh, I'm... Damien Haas is a dear friend of mine who I love very, very much. Um, and then I met uh, Shane once at a convention because he was visiting Damien. And um, I've met Anthony once randomly because um, my friend knows him and we ran into him at Halloween Horror Nights one time. And so, yeah, um, the only one I really know is Damien, but... Anthony and Shane both seem lovely, and of course they're lovely, because Damien's wonderful, and so if Damien hangs out with you, you're probably, that's a pretty good judge of character right there. Okay, this first one is, can't listen because I'm out and about, but hope you're feeling better. Thank you, dude, Enoch. <laughs> All right, um, this one goes out to Brandon Marino. It is this beautiful, sparkly, little Yoimiya star print, and, uh, he says, any voice line, dealer's choice. And so, I'm gonna do that. I don't know if anyone else here is a part of the Upset Tummy Club, but it's not great. It's not ideal, and it's not what I wanted. <laughs> Especially because, like, it's been going on for a while, too. Like, I have IBS, and so sometimes it just flares up, and it's miserable for about, like, a week or so, and then I'm able to move past it. And now it's been, like, two, three weeks, and it hasn't... I haven't moved past it yet, and it's not fun for me because I really miss food, and I love food, and I can't really eat food, and it's very, very sad. And just to prove that uh, I'm legit, I do have my Pedialyte here, rocking it there, some sweet representation for the Upset Tummy Club. I feel the IFIBS also. Yeah, it's not great. It's not my favorite thing, I tell you what. Uh, I had... A friend who like went to all this trouble like oh, there's pickles hey little girl I went who and a friend like go to all this trouble yesterday to like make me this like really nice meal and I felt so bad because I only took like two bites of it and I, I physically couldn't eat anymore before my stomach started hurting and like he spent hours on it but he was, it was like it was so nice and so generous and then he made me coffee too and I just I couldn't enjoy any of it and it was not fun <laughs> uh, yeah is no bueno. Is no bueno. Wait, but where'd you go? You were just here. I don't know where she went. I think she went into the void. She'll be back soon eventually. She'll be back eventually. Um, but yeah, any voice line, let's do Here Come the Fireworks. Okay. How are you guys tonight? Hopefully you are good. And if anyone else there is feeling sickly and in a funk like ya girl here, then I am sending you lots of love out into the ether because I don't think anyone should feel this way. Except for, you know, really bad shitty people, in which case they should feel this way every day. Like if you do, you know, bullying or hate crimes, you deserve an upset tummy. That's my hot take. Um, let's 
There you go. I'm at work, slow night because heavy rain. Heavy rain honestly sounds nice. I think it's supposed to rain here in LA tomorrow, which I'm actually honestly looking forward to because I don't know. I feel like, I don't know, when you're like feeling low and sick and kind of sad, like staying inside and have like, like having it like really heavy rain outside is just very relaxing and very nice and it's like kind of cathartic. So I'm kind of looking forward to that and I'm hoping it does rain. Um, ba da da da! Brandon Marino, here you go. Ta da! I did it! Hooray! Okay, that one's, that one's done. Oh, Pickles is right next to my feet. You guys can't see her, but I can. Hello. Hello, kitty. Hello, kitty cat. Hello, good girl. That one's done. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Super Smash Bros. fan, thank you so much. That's so nice. Like the characters of Stranger Things, but yes, sending much love. I really appreciate you. Yeah. Who's your guys' favorite character on Stranger Things? I'm biased. Um, but I like Dustin, but that's also because I've met, uh, Gaten Matarazzo, and he's very, very nice. <laughs> um, so <laughs> I'm kind of biased. Um, let's see. This next one is for Rosie. I like that name for so many reasons. Um, one, because roses are my favorite flower. Um, and pink is my favorite color, and rose is another, like, you know, term for pink mo oftentimes. And also, because I had a- I had a dog named Rosie growing up. So, yeah. Steve Harrington? Ooh, yeah. I think at, next to Dustin, Steve Harrington is probably my favorite, too. And then, like, right behind- it's like, uh, it's like, it's Dustin, and then Steve and Eddie are, like, tied for second. Actually, they might be all tied for first, if I'm being honest. Um... And if anyone else from Stranger Things is watching, specifically, uh, Raphael, you're you're such a good kid. You're such a good little nephew. But but yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> I have Rose in my name. Yeah. Okay, this is to Rosie. What a beautiful name. If I was more artistically inclined, I would try to draw a rose. But that is far outside of my depth. So <laughs> I'm not going to try and tarnish this pretty print drawn by Akuo <laughs> with my amateurish little ro rose that will end up just looking like a bunch of blobs stuck together. I will not tarnish the reputation of roses with that depiction. I shall not do that. Okay. Hi, hi. Okay. Ta-da! Here is the print. It's so cute. Oh, thank you. Nick, it's your birthday. You're not supposed to give me money on your birthday. Nick! That's not how this works. I appreciate you. But no! Nick! Okay, when I come to New York, I'm buying you coffee and cheesecake. You can't escape it, okay? Okay, there's this one. I'm gonna fight you, Nick. I'm not gonna get... Caleb to do it though because I think he'll get lost Caleb is a good boy <laughs> he will get lost <laughs> um what did you eat that made your stomach ache I I genuinely don't know um I had COVID for a second time earlier this month, and so it's like, that could be it, that it's just like the residual crud um, in there knocking around, but I also have IBS and it's just like gastritis and like I have a really sensitive stomach overall, so it really literally could be anything. Um, sometimes it's like a very clear indicator what I ate. Like I remember sometime last year I got really sick from my IBS because I, um, um, I wanted to get this video monetized, so I effed around and found out, and I tried to eat a spicy chicken sandwich, and the very next day I was terribly, terribly ill. But this time around, I genuinely, I genuinely don't know what's wrong with my stomach, but there's something wrong with it, and I don't like it! I wanted to cut it out! Pretty soon, please! My plan for this weekend was that uh, me and one of my best friends were going to go 
on a little like road trip and we're gonna go and like eat a bunch of yummy food and due to like my tummy ache and other unforeseen circumstances I can't do that now and I don't like that um okay bye Nick happy birthday buddy my older nephew and his mom tested positive this week. It's sad because Tuesday was supposed to be his first school concert. Oh, JP, I'm so sorry. Yeah, COVID, COVID is no good. COVID, COVID stinks very, very much so. It's so frustrating too because ever since I, I got better, like I got on Paxlovid the day I tested positive. Like I was, like I took, you know, I did like all the right things. I kept my fluids up. I got Paxlovid. I, you know, didn't take Advil. I slept as much as I could. And even with all of those precautions, I, like, I still am suffering really bad, like, brain fog and dealing with uh, issues with mental clarity and my memory with a uh, post-COVID brain. And it's, it stinks. So I'm going to send lots of um, love and thoughts and prayers to your family. I'm sorry. Um, Jenny got to ask, is there anything you want to know about Ezreal before watching it? I don't think so. Um, everything will be good. Thank you, Super Smash Bros. fan. I appreciate you. Yeah, it was not, it was not good. And it, like, it came out of nowhere and just hit me like a freight train too, which was especially not fun. Like, I was feeling fine for the most part. I was dealing with some stress. But the day before, I just, like, was dealing with, like, allergies. And the next morning, I woke up and I felt like death. And I tested for COVID right away. And I tested positive. And then within, like, the hour or so I had a fever of 103 and it was crazy and it was not great so uh please remember to mask up guys because it is going around and it is really nasty and I don't want you guys suffering the same kind of mental uh like side effects that I am because it's not great um thank you so much for subscribing Ash I appreciate you um this one is to Riley um it is a shi'i print it's very well out with the old and in with the new pup New though in puppet and form, I fully functional. I can do that. Can you also draw a little wrench and screwdriver, please? I can definitely do that. That's very cute. I like that. Okay. I'm very excited because now that shit is out, like when I sign these prints, because before people would be like, oh, like you can just uh, sign your favorite quote. And I'm like, she doesn't have any quotes right now, or really. Like she has a few that she was it, that she said in like some story quests, but also it's like, the reason I'm able to, like, memorize Yoi Mia's line so easily is because I'm able to go through the menu and, like, you know, like, click all of them and be like, okay, now I remember them. But he wasn't out for the longest time, and so it's like, I don't remember what I said. I recorded her. Not recently. <laughs> and so now there are quotes, and so this is easier now. <laughs> I really appreciate my friends because with me being sick both with COVID and now with not COVID and just tummy troubles and brain troubles um my friends have been very very nice to me um I had a friend come over today who uh made me this very very bland tummy friendly soup which I really appreciate and uh we hung out for a while um just because I was feeling a little bit down and I felt bad because when he left, he's like, okay, try and get some rest. And I was like, I, I, I'll, I'll try. And I didn't tell him that I was streaming tonight. And so I'm like, I'll, I'll try. No one tell him, please. Uh, okay. The amount of focus I have right now because my brain is so fritzy. It's on the fritz. Is crazy. I'm like, don't write the wrong thing. Don't write the wrong thing. For the first time a few months ago, I actually wrote uh, a Yoimiya quote backwards which was like the thing that i've been scared of doing for the longest time because the quote is fireworks are for now but friends are forever and for like as long as i've been writing that quote I, i've always like worried i'm like i know that one day i'm going to write friends are for now but fireworks are forever and sure enough that for, sure enough that day finally happened and that was uh 
very upsetting to say the least um here's hoping february treats you nicer jenny for your birthday at least yeah my birthday is next week uh for those of you who don't know my birthday is february 11th it's next sunday um i'm gonna be in puerto rico for kawaii con which i'm very excited for i've never been to puerto rico i'm a little bit nervous uh because i've never been there before and i don't know anyone but i'm really excited to meet new people and to see puerto rico for the first time but yeah i'm Fingers crossed it's a good birthday. I think it will be, just purely based on the fact that I'll get to meet all of the wonderful people at Kauai Kun. Um, okay, now I have to draw a little wrench and a screwdriver, please. Okay. It's so crazy, because, like, it was not too long ago that uh, I had to use screwdrivers. I'm gonna draw a flathead screwdriver, because it's easier to draw than a Philip said. Um, <laughs> it does not. I'm gonna label it. There we go. Because it does not look right. But it's got personality. Okay. Okay, I know what a wrench looks like, though. I can do that one a little bit better. There we go. That one looks pretty cute. Okay, there we go. Da-da-da-da! Ta-da! Um... Ah! There we go. There we go. Flathead. <laughs> um, oh, Jenny, hope you get to meet Iron Mouse there. Is she's coming there? I have no idea. I would love to meet Iron Mouse one day. Because I hear that she's a big fan of Cinema Roll. And so, that'd be very fun. And I'm a fan of hers, because she seems really sweet and nice. Um, if I watch, I mean, I was, I'm a huge Star Wars fan. Star Wars was my, like, entire personality along with Pokemon up until I was, like, 19 or so. Um... And so, yeah, I, yeah I'm I was obsessed with Star Wars. Um, I remember I was there for the midnight premiere opening night of... Red... Oh, boy. The Force Awakens. The Force Awakens. I'm like, this is what I'm talking about with my memory. Like, it's so bad now. For the first one with Rey and Finn and Poe. Um, I was there for opening night, midnight premiere for The Force Awakens, and, uh, I don't want to say anything in case somehow someone has evaded the spoiler, but there's a pretty big death in that movie, and I gasped, and I think I screamed when it happened, um, because I was also, like, wearing a dress that was, like, decorated to look like that character's costume, and so I was pretty devastated when that happened. Uh, oh, Biggles, did you hear- she said something. She went, ah. She She's upset about that character, too. Um, but yeah, that, that moment for sure had me shook. Do people still say that? Is that still uh, relevant? Am I still hip with the kids? Even though I'm Gen Z, I'm, I am the kids. My COVID scare was like a week before I had to travel in July 2022. And I managed to test negative and feel better before going. I'm really glad that happened. Yeah, it would be a really big bummer. Um... Yeah, I love Star Wars. Uh, Mad Frit says, oh, oh, best girl, v best girl VA. Hey, hey, hi. That's really nice of you. I appreciate that. That's very sweet. Okay. Uh, this one's for Nicholas Palmer. Alright. Let's see. To Nicholas Palmer. It says my favorite. This one's Diesel. Ta da! It's Diesel. Um, it's my favorite Diesel quote. Um, I think it's going to be care for some strawberry candy. I'm 
going to draw, draw a little piece of candy here. Or at least I'm going to try my best. There we go. That's kind of cute. Yeah. It's cute. Okay, great. Okay, there we go. Da 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 da. I don't know why <laughs> I always make the little Legend of Zelda noise whenever I finish uh, signing a print, but it feels correct. It feels appropriate and accurate. Okay, let's see. Um, let's see. Did you keep the energy throughout all the sequels? I tried my best, and that's what I'll say about it. I yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Mm-hmm. I still love Star Wars. I sure do still love Star Wars, but... Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's actually uh, how I met Alejandro for the first time. Was uh, we were both taking a workshop uh, for a voiceover, and afterwards... Um, we were all taking a workshop, and then afterwards, uh, this is back when workshops were in person, a bunch of the actors who were participating uh, went out to a diner, and we were all talking and everything. And me and Alejandro got into a debate about Star Wars. <laughs> and now, now we've been friends, then we've been friends ever since, so it's been great, yeah. Um, Alejandro loves Star Wars. Like, he knows, I thought I knew a lot about Star Wars, but he knows way more about it than me. <laughs> I think he has like 10 lightsabers and they're all like the custom built ones that you can get get for yourself at Disneyland. It's crazy. Um, Jenny, do you want to voice more characters in the Pokemon anime? Yes, absolutely. I do. Uh, I was just watching the Pokemon anime with my friend who came over um, because it's one of my comfort shows that like is guaranteed to make me feel a little bit better because when life is hard, Pokemon's there to remind you that there's still lots of great things in the world. Okay, this one's for, uh, Gogi? Okay. Okay, she... They want a special quote from each character. I can do that. I can do that. Let's see... Hmm. I'm gonna do happy birthday to me, but more importantly, happy Halloween for Karomi. True story. My dad was one of the original star was one of the original Star Wars when they first came out. That's fun. Um, that sounds incredibly on brand for him. Oh, Alejandro and arguing arguing about Star Wars. Yep, absolutely it was. Doesn't matter if he just he has just met you or not. If he if you say something he disagrees with when it comes to something, especially Star Wars, you pre better prepare yourself to face his wrath. And I did. <laughs> he let me have it. But it's all good because I thought it was really entertaining. I'm like, I like this guy. He cares about things a lot. And we've been friends ever since. He's one of my favorite people. Let's see. Um, and cinema roll. Let's see. Uh, cinema roll. I'm gonna do, uh... Mmm... Hmm. I forget. What's a good cinema roll quote? I mean, I just think of like, oh, 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 do you cinema roll? I think I might do that one. Um. Let's see.
There we go. Ta da! Okay. There we go. There we go. Okay, let's see. I learned about Jenny when I was playing my favorite game, Fire Emblem Heroes. Learned she voiced Eleonora, Elise, and Astrid. Personally thought Astrid would sound a little cuter and refined. <laughs> well, you know, I tried my best. Um, let's see. And when I heard her voice in Nita in Pokemon Masters, she popped off. Oh, thank you. I love my work as Nita in Pokemon Masters. She was really fun to play. <laughs> I think... I can't remember. I think Nita might have been the first Pokemon thing that I ever booked, and I think I'm I think I might have cried. <laughs> Cause I love Pokemon so much. It's my favorite thing. Okay, this one is for Evelyn. And this one says, also please write a special quote from each character. I can do that. <laughs> I just did that. Pat! Hi, Pat! Hi, friend! Guys, the voice- Pat- Pat Petroza is here! Like, Scaramouche! Hello, friend! Wanderer! Hello! Thank you for coming to my stream! What's your favorite Pokemon? Snorlax. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Actually, no lemon squeezy, because citrus upsets my stomach. And I don't need more of that right now. Um... What do you think of Hideo Kojima? And his games? I think they're very cool and they're very artsy. Hi, Brent! Hi, Pat! Okay. Now I write special quote from each character. Don Sombrero? <laughs> Jenny, do you collect uh, Pokemon cards? I do collect Pokemon cards. I still have all the Pokemon cards that I've ever collected ever since I was a little girl. Um, for Chromie, I'm gonna say cheeky but charming, because that's her little like tagline that they put on all her merch. And then, let's see, am I doing any better? Um, yes and no. It's like, I feel a lot better than I did yesterday because um, I haven't had much to eat today, which is sad, but yeah, it's like, I can't really put anything in my stomach without it getting angry at me. Um, but I haven't really put anything in my stomach today, so it's, it's okay. It's like, it's, it's like, it's called for a truce at the time being, but yeah, I, I miss food very much. I miss food very much so. Um, okay, for cinnamon roll. Uh, let me see. Ah, ba 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 ba. For cinnamon roll, I'm also gonna do. Oh, 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 do the cinnamon roll because I like that one a lot. Let's see, um, I forgot where I discovered Jenny was number of places at once. I'm in your walls. I'm hiding in your walls like the raccoon, like the raccoon I am. I forgot to sign the last one because I, I got that sweet, sweet uh, post-COVID brain fog, so that's cool and fun and I like that and I'm not upset or sad about that at all. Yay! Okay. Those are done. Those? Those are done. Those are no more. They're, they're all done. Those are all done. Pickles <laughs> just kind of like... <laughs> Hanging out underneath my desk. For those of you who don't know, Pickles is my cat, and she's just kind of like hanging out beneath my desk right now. And I, she's kind of like chilling. I'm like, okay. Um, this next one is for Renee. Okay, we got this pretty one. Ta da! It's a pretty little uh, magical girly going Mia print. 
Um, uh, Renee wants fireworks are for now, but friends are forever with a little drawing of some fireworks. Thank you so much. I can do that, Renee. I'm going to try my best with the fireworks because I'm not very good at drawing fireworks. You'd think I'd be better at drawing them by now, but you'd be wrong. <laughs> Okay. I was just talking about how I've always been scared I'm gonna mess up this quote. Now I'm like, oh no, don't mess up this quote again. Don't do it. Don't do it. You know, I did, uh, you know how I was like, don't do it. Well, I did, I did, I did just do it. So I have to go get a new print because that thing I asked myself not to do was, it turned out it was the thing that I did. Ah! I'll be back. brain cell and she's fighting for her life constantly was your taste thrown off my taste wasn't thrown off actually that was I was expecting it to be but um it was not and so that was you know tiny blessings you know I'll take those tiny little tiny little wins Okay, now I'm gonna do it right this time, I swear! Ah. Okay, complete focus. Okay, there we go. Okay, now a drawing of some fireworks. Oh. It's off to a rough start already. Okay. Okay. Oh. Uh-oh. Well, you know what? I'm drawing it with a lot of love, and I hope that Renee can hopefully appreciate that. Oh. Mm. Okay. <laughs> it's not going well. But they've got some personality! So that's great! Okay. Oh boy. Yeah, these are, these are not my best works. <laughs> okay, there we go! Great! Hooray! Okay, this one's done. Ah. Ah. Um, okay, that one's done. Okay, this next one is for Roger. I have a friend named Roger. And he likes One Piece. <laughs> and Pokemon. <laughs> and pizza. Roger's a good guy. Very sweet boy. Okay. Okay, there we go. Wah! Okay, there we go. Ta-da! one now we go to the next one. Oh, straps yay okay i'm glad that you like it yay hooray 
Okay, this one, this next one is for, oh, I don't know how to pronounce this name, but it's E-N-O-C-H. And it's for a black lemonade cookie print. It's very cool. I like this print a lot. My friend Jen drew it, and she's very cool and talented. Okay. Enoch didn't put any special instructions on instructions on here, so I'm going to assume that it's okay if I just write my signature. Okay, there we go. That one's done. That one was quick. That one's done. Hi, Pickles. She's just kind of staring at me. She's looking at me right now. Okay, this next one's for Rhea. Oh, no, it's this quote again. Okay, I can do that. Uh, Rhea says, can you please write fireworks are for now, but friends are forever on it too. I would really appreciate that. Also, thank you so much for your awesome work. Keep going hard. Oh, Rhea, I appreciate you. That's really nice. That's Rhea in nice. That was nothing, but I tried my best to make that pun work. Okie dokie. Cool beans. Ah, please. Ah. Okay. Okay, two, three, uh, let me write this quote correctly, please. Okay, focus, complete focus. sad I didn't get to pull for Yoimiya and Sha'i uh, while well, they were doing their things. I wanted to, but that's when I was sick. I was a sick little girl. And so I couldn't really get out of bed without being very upset. Okay, that one's done! Okay, this next one- Ooh, this is a cool name! Uh, their name is Z! That's so cool! Also, I'm drinking some Pedialyte. Because <laughs> I need to stay hydrated. Hooray! Thank you, Pedialyte! For making sure I don't die! Ah! Oh boy, I got a big month coming up, gang. I am going to three conventions uh, this month, and it's going to be, and they're going to be back to back to back, which is going to be a little bit crazy, but I'm very excited for it. I shall head out as it's 3 a.m. for me. Thank you again for signing my print. Thank you, Strobs. Thank you for coming. Get some good rest. Bye bye. Um, okay. This one, this next one is for Z. This, uh, that is such a cool name. I really like that name. I also have, like, a very strong affinity for anyone with a Z in their name. Just because, since my, just because, like, as someone with the last name that starts with Y, I have, like, a very strong, like, sense of, like, kinship with anyone else towards the end of the alphabet. I'm like, you get it. You know what it was what it was like in elementary school when they would be like, okay, line up, line up according to the alphabet, and you'd be like the last, and you'd be like, mm, I don't want to be last. Stinky, stinks, not fun. Can 
cannot say the end, sadly. Have a good signing. I hope the summit gets less testy. Wishing you and the summit better relationship going forward. Me too. It's been very mean to me lately. Oh, that's right. Yeah, on uh, Sunday, I'm going to be taking part in the Cookie Run uh, Kingdom live stream, which I'm very excited about. I love Cookie Run Kingdom, and it's so fun that I'm a part of it. Okay, there we go. I drew some... Yeah, I drew this. Jenny is such a Karomi. <laughs> That's fair. <laughs> she and I are a lot alike. And we even sound similar. At least some people say so. Okay, that, that one's done. Okay. Speaking of Cookie Run Kingdom, the last print for tonight is... Uh, another black lemonade cookie print. Hooray, yay! I love this print, it's so cute. This one's to Miranda. There we go. We'll get the lines a little bit thicker so it looks better showing up. Okay. Okay, cool beans, yay. Okay, we did it! We did it! Good job, you guys! Okay. Cool beans, yay! Yay! We did it! Okay, everybody. So, um, I am still not feeling very good. And so I'm really sorry that uh, for the short stream and that I have to cut it short. I know usually, I know usually I stream for much longer than this, and I feel bad that I can't really do that tonight. But I have to take care of my health and make sure I get better. Um, but you're all really wonderful, and I appreciate all of you. And thank you so much for coming and hanging out with me for my stream, and thank you for buying prints, and for subscribing, and for your super chats. I really really appreciate all of you more than i can really say and i hope all of you have a really great rest of your day or afternoon or evening or night or whatever you have coming up for you and i really thank you for taking some time out of your day to spend it with me i appreciate you guys all right bye everybody bye